brumation you need to remember the term that's it what it is okay so what is hibernation what is aestivation hibernation aestivation oh okay. see when we consider hibernation aestivation brumation they are metabolic inactivity okay these terms are majorly in cases of we use when metabolic inactivity occurs in various species okay so similarly we have got uh, apart from hibernation and aestivation another term is brumation okay now why is it a new researchers have observed instant instances of brumation on various reptilian species across habitats okay now as i said it is a state of metabolic inactivity so it's a state of sluggishness inactivity or torpor exhibited by reptiles during winter or extended periods of low temperature because of scarcity of food okay this we can equate nearly to hibernation okay hibernation is also the metabolic reduced metabolic activity it is not it cannot be equated properly to sleep because sleep we have normal breathing when in case of hibernation the breathing also gets lost okay so here the metabolic activity is totally get inactive or very very slow okay so this happens during the winter similarly brumation also happens during the winter okay when in case of aestivation it is summer sleep okay aestivation it is summer sleep now brumation brumation is also winter sleep it is a period of dormancy in reptiles similar to hibernation in mammals to conserve energy and survive the adverse environmental conditions okay so remember hibernation and also brumation occurs in winter it's winter sleep now aestivation is summer sleep okay what is the purpose of these all to conserve energy okay to also to tackle the adverse environmental conditions when the environmental conditions become normal they will be back to their normal procedure or normal life that's it okay now when it is seen in the reptiles it is known as brumation and when it is seen in the uh, mammals for that uh, actually polar bears also show a kind of hibernation only okay but when we say hibernation and aestivation hibernation is of longer duration rather compared to aestivation aestivation is summer sleep that is usually of shorter duration okay now during brumation reptiles may retreat to underground burrows rock crevices or other shelter areas where temperatures are relatively more stable okay when reptiles they are not able to tackle the lower temperature or the winter season they will go into brumation clear now in what all uh species it is seen it is seen in turtles tortoise snakes lizards and some amphibians like frogs bearded dragons is the most brumating of all the known reptiles okay now it is a why is it brumation necessary it's a crucial survival strategy for reptile reptiles to survive cold climates endure challenging environmental conditions until they reemerge to feed and reproduce in favorable climates okay clear so brumation hibernation aestivation all are metabolic inactivity to tackle the uh, adverse conditions adverse environmental conditions as to con and to conserve energy okay when we consider hibernation as well as brumation it is winter sleep okay mostly to tackle the winter lower temperatures brumation is mostly seen in reptiles and for that matter the uh, hibernation is seen in mammals okay now winter sleep is of much higher duration compared to aestivation aestivation is of summer sleep that is of shorter duration clear okay 